Let's cross now to France 24's James Andre, who's in Conakry. Um, you're outside the hotel, James, where the ECOWAS talks are being held. Uh, tell us more. Yes, absolutely. The ECOWAS delegation arrived this morning with uh, the foreign affairs ministers from Ghana, Burkina Faso, Togo and Nigeria. Uh, they were... Uh, taken, they were at the airport, they were received uh, by members of the junta close uh, to Mamadi Dumbuya, but he was not there in person. Uh, then they crossed the whole city of Conakry, which uh, there were roadblocks pretty much everywhere, and brought here. This is the Riviera Hotel. This is one of the luxury hotels here uh, in central Conakry. It is very close to the Special Forces HQ, and it is unclear where the talks will actually uh, be taking place. What I can tell you is that we've been standing here uh, for a bit now, and we did see a group of members of these Special Forces leap into uh, four by four here and a move one of them was there again uh, one of the colonels close uh, to Mamadi Dumbuya so it's unclear how things are going but if you look at the official schedule at 2 p.m. Uh, there should be uh, talks 2 p.m. local time and then uh, the delegation is due to depart from Conakry at 5 p.m. local time. So James what actually is expected from this visit by the ECOWAS uh, delegation? Now, one of the things the ECOWAS delegation is going to want to do is try to secure the liberation of ousted President Alpha Conde. Probably going to try and meet him today. But once again, we have very little information. The press has not been kept very informed. But we do know that that is one of ECOWAS's main goals, to secure a quick liberation of Alpha Conde. Now, we did speak uh, to uh, one of the colonels close uh, to uh, Mamadi Dumbuya, and we were told yesterday that Alpha Conde is in good form. We were told uh, that indeed he is seeing his doctors and that the doctors are reporting directly to the junta. Another thing uh, is that, of course, ECOWAS is going to try and see what the parameters of a transition uh, toward the uh, constitutional order here is the country are. Once again, it's important to remember that at this stage, ECOWAS has not slapped any major sanctions on the country. Borders are open. There have been no asset freezes at this stage. One other development right now is also the fact that the African Union has suspended Guinea's membership. That has been announced today. Thank you for that. Uh, that's James Andre.